Hey everyone, welcome to Preeti's Kitchen. Today let's make something special for Christmas. This is a quick recipe which is perfect gift for your loved ones. It's a popular Filipino dessert which is a regular sight in all the bakeries. It is sweet, chewy and gooey. Just delicious. I promise you, you will not stop at one bar. It is called Food for the Gods. So let's get started. So let's start with uh, greasing a pan. I have taken a 9 by 9 inch pan which I have greased it and I've lined it with the parchment paper. I've let these sides hung so that it's easier to pull it out with the bars. So we'll keep this aside. Make sure that your oven is preheated to 350 degrees Fahrenheit or 180 degrees Celsius. I have my flour which is the all purpose flour. Mix salt. I've taken fine sea salt about 5 grams. About 2 grams of cinnamon powder. Baking powder. About 2.5 grams. We'll mix this nicely. At this point, I will also add walnuts to this and chopped pine pitted dates. There's a variation that you can try. You can soak your uh, uh, dry fruits. Um, in rum also or orange juice if you are non-alcoholic and uh, about overnight just soak them and you can use it in the bar the next day these are not soaked I'm just giving you a variation if you like to make it a little more uh, Christmassy with a rum flavor in your bars you can do that as well all right, this is done. I'll keep this aside. In a clean bowl, which I've taken a large bowl here, I will add butter, which is melted and it is cooled. To this, I will add sugar, brown sugar, whole eggs. Now what I did with uh, eggs was I uh, Use three eggs, I beat them well and then I weigh them 216 grams, so I remove the excess. Okay, because each egg weighs almost about 50 to 51 grams. So I had to uh, first beat three of them and then take out 116 grams. Also to this we will add vanilla, which I'm taking one teaspoon. Take a good brand, unsulfured brand. I'm taking the rare brand, uh, rabbit brand. It's unsulfured, non GMO. You could do the same. Now I'm going to weigh it because I need 20 grams of molasses. This will give a nice color, nice dark brown color, and also flavor. The nice dark brown color that you see in your Christmas cakes, the fruit cakes, is because of the molasses that they use. That's 20 grams of molasses. Also 60 grams of glucose. Glucose is added to make your cake soft. That's it. We'll mix this well. At this time, I will use my electric heater and at low speed, not a high speed. So this is done. Let's keep this aside. To this, we are going to add our flour mixture in which the walnuts and dates are already there. Alright, let's put this into our pan. Okay, 
This is a delicious dessert. I can promise you that you'll just love it. We'll bake this for about 20 to 25 minutes until you see it is pale golden in color. And then we'll cool it down and then cut into bars of our desired size. So I'm going to put this in the oven now. So this is out of the oven. I've already cooled it. Now you can cut them into square shapes. I hope you've enjoyed this video. If you have, please like, share and subscribe. And thank you for watching.